Water. Water. I need water. Oh, hi folks. Doc Jake from Sioux Nation Ag Center here. This drought's getting pretty bad and I don't know if it could get any worse. Oh, it got worse. Okay, so it's not that bad, but we're still drier than we should be. We've been doing a series of videos on different ways that we can save grass in our pastures this year. One way that we can do that is to ultrasound the cows while out on pasture. The reason for this is simple. If we can identify the open cows and get them off the grass sooner, that means they're eating less grass that we need to save for our bred cows. The advantage of using ultrasound rather than palpation is simple. Using ultrasound, we can identify if a cow is bred or open as early as 28 days of gestation. Palpation means that we have to wait all the way up to 45 days of gestation. That's just one of the advantages of using ultrasound out on pasture. With ultrasound, we have two other advantages. First, we can see if the fetus is still viable. If a cow is in the process of slipping the calf while we are ultrasounding, we'll be able to pick that up on ultrasound. In addition, ultrasound is more accurate than palpation at determining the age of the fetus. If the fetus is aged prior to 100 days of gestation, ultrasound can give us an actual due date as compared to an estimate that we get with palpation. Oh, hey, Doc. Say, are there any disadvantages to ultrasounding your cattle while they're out on grass? I, I think it's a girl. Well, Generic Rancher Ron, there are a couple disadvantages to ultrasounding cattle on pasture. The primary disadvantage is many pastures don't have a facility available to run cattle through. Now, if you're in this situation, one way you can help manage this is by using a portable corral system. If you don't own one, oftentimes they are available to rent in an area not very far from where you're at. Now, the other disadvantage that's inherent with ultrasounding cattle is it is a little slower than palpation if you're trying to age the fetus. In order to get the age of the fetus, we've got to line up the head of that calf just right so we can measure the diameter across it. That takes a little bit longer than sticking your hand in there and getting an estimate based upon the size of the calf. So these two, these two disadvantages have to be considered when we're looking at ultrasounding cattle, but both of them are things that we can overcome with little time and preparation. So folks, despite some disadvantages, ultrasounding your cows on grass is still a good way to save pasture for the cows that have babies in them. If you're interested in doing this, reach out to one of our veterinarians at Sioux Nation Ag Center. We have veterinarians on staff that are experienced with ultrasounding to be both accurate and efficient because those two qualities are key to feeding that bottom line. Now about that water. Gosh, I need water. What? Hey, look, water. Oh, hey, Doc. Say, are there any disadvantage to ultrasounding your cattle while they're out on? <laughs> That'll go in the flavors. So folks, it's so freaking hot, I can't think. I get that all the time. <laughs> Somebody thinks they're funny. <laughs>